What's up guys, Doma here. Today I'm going to be showing you how to change your resolution. Quick reminder, this tutorial is only made for Android devices. So if you're iOS or Windows 10, this tutorial is not for you. I advise you to click off. But well, leave a like before you do and subscribe. And yeah, let's get started. There's two ways of changing your resolution. You can either use a PC or you can do, do it with a rooted device, which I'm using right now. I don't have a P I don't have a PC to show you right now, so I'll just leave a link in the description to show you how to do it. If your phone's not rooted and you have a PC, then you can change your resolution. But for now, I'm gonna show you how you do it for a rooted Android device. And I recommend only for phones or 16 by 10 tablets. I'm not sure if your if your device is a 4x3 Android tablet. I don't recommend reusing it, but you can go ahead and try. So for doing it for rooted devices, I use Resolution Changer, which is the best one for me, in my opinion, because it has presets and a lot of features that you use, such as aspect ratio, and there's a slider, so it can give you specific types of 9 by 16 by 9 resolutions that you can use. And then you can go in the advanced features and then you can pick the resolution you want and the density but i don't recommend using overscan because i don't use it but i have presets which i use my home screen right last just a bunch of weird names but the one i mainly use now is the last one 990 by 7 by 1760 this is the one I'm currently using for all my videos, so yeah, it's a good resolution. I would recommend it for most of you guys, but if you do want to find like a good resolution, I'll show you right now. So if you're looking for resolutions for yourself or like resolution you think you can use, go on Google, Google Chrome and type in 16 by 9 resolution. And then you're gonna link you're gonna go to this link called oh, true list of 16 by 9 resolutions if you're gonna pick a resolution i recommend this website because it gives you the right aspect ratio going from 16 by 9 and it goes up and here's where i found my resolution when i use for most of my videos well, I just I just go on this link I'll leave it in the description to make it easier for you guys so yeah if you're gonna look for a resolution I recommend testing these out and I don't recommend you going below let's say 1720 uh, 720 and before you think of doing like modifications to your device and resolution I recommend you check check your device specs you can use the app CPU-Z it gives you all the information about your device so it gives me the exact pixel ratio and screen resolution that I have uh, for Samsung S6 I know that it says Samsung 9 it's because I ported it so it's a uh, Samsung 9 on a Samsung 6 so yeah when I checked out the specifications for this device, I could use 2K, so that is 2560 by 1440. So I, there's an option in the camera section. I didn't realize you can do this. I can use 4K, and I've recently started testing it out, and I can play. I can put my screen resolution to 4K, and it's pretty good because I can see see everything basically better pixels and I don't get that much lag for this type of device so yeah just check the specifications for your device and see if it can handle what you're doing with the device because it can it this is basically a kind of like an overclocking but it, it will work and when you change your resolution like lower it lower it it will increase your FPS so yeah I recommend people doing this if they're having FPS problems or issues. So yeah. 
So basically how to change your resolution on the app, you can use either simple or advanced to change your width, height, and density. Press apply, your screen will turn off, turn on back. Click yes and accept before the 20 second timer runs out. Then your resolution is changed. Oh, and there's one thing I need to mention. After you hit the apply button, you'll have 20 second, you'll have a 20 second timer. And if you don't press and accept before 20 seconds, your resolution will go back to normal how is how you got your device. So yeah. Now I'm going to show you a comparison of my resolution and 2K resolution in game. You can see that the 2K resolution is more sharp and blurry around the edges while as my resolution is has no blur but it's pixelated but you can see everything that you need to see so yeah guys i've pretty much covered everything i need on this tutorial so yeah next tutorial i'm not sure but everyone's been asking me how to do stretch i'm just gonna wait for the 0.11 update then I'll do another stretch tutorial video. So yeah guys, hope you enjoy the video. Hope this helps. And yeah, peace out. Fuck it. Rico <laughs>